this party scene is very trippy. I really uh, missed out on the other party scene because uh, I solved the puzzle so quickly I didn't even get to talk to everyone. So I'm going to enjoy this nightclub. I'm going to just enjoy the lights, enjoy the music. Everyone's rolling on ecstasy. They might be rolling on the river. Sexy in a dumb way. Every gangster likes his girl sexy in a dumb way. Just look at all these girls dancing. They animated all of these characters just in case you decided to get close to them and look at them. I mean, imagine how much effort must have gone into this. They probably didn't hand animate them. They probably used motion capture, but they had to like, you know, photograph all of these actors and actresses dancing, probably one by one in like a motion capture chamber and then use a computer to integrate them all into the same environment and create polygon models for them. This was like a lot of work. That looks like the guy who was at the party, the guy who uh, was drunk off of his ass and helped us create a distraction. It looks like I've seen her somewhere too, this lady to my right. Did they reuse some of like the background characters maybe from the mall scene at the beginning? This guy looks like you can talk to him. Maybe? Maybe I can walk by him? Sorry lady, you might have guessed only. I think that's Paco back there. Yeah, that's Paco right there um, in the big goofy glasses and the striped shirt that makes it look like he killed something with ferocious fangs in order to obtain that. So what can I do to be sexy in a dumb way? Do I have to, uh, maybe talking to this chick who's dancing over here will do it? Just sexiness by association? Oh, I can dance. This is the girl power scene. Where the girl uses her charm to get the attention of the super villain so she can wrestle information out of him. Whoa! She's dancing in heels. It's so hard to do. No, I don't want to step down. I want to try it again. Not that I've ever tried dancing in heels. I wouldn't know from personal experience that that's hard to do, but uh... All right, one more time. Whoa! Do you have to do it twice in a row? I'm just gonna keep dancing until something happens. I feel like the button sequence is different every time, or maybe I'm just really bad. I'm just really bad, it's the same. Let's step down off of this. Obviously nothing is happening. Don't forget your bag, Madison. You may need to hit someone over the head with it soon. This Paco is one of the buddies of Dr. Death. I don't want you to step. Yeah, there was a lot of intuition. Is this the ladies' room or is this the men's room? I think this is the ladies' room. Even though it's right next to the blue men symbol. Watch, there's two gay guys fucking in the toilet. Oops, wrong room. Time to play the sexy girl. Yeah, I just gotta like dumb up my appearance a little bit. 
That looks good on you, Madison. You look good no matter what. You look good wearing a potato sack. Loosen your top a little bit. Show some cleavage. What else? Just hang like a used condom out of your pocket. Oh my god, I got it right in my eye. I'm blind. The scene looks awesome, by the way. They rendered Madison in incredibly high detail. Like, she looks pretty realistic even from close up. <laughs> She's tearing her skirt. This is awesome. All right, now I'm showing some cleavage. I'm wearing a super short skirt. I have bimbo hair. Should I dye my hair blonde? No, she's gonna reach back into her bag full of goodies. Lipstick. A little lipstick never hurt. Did she have a gun when she was in the doctor's place? Maybe she carries a gun with her everywhere she goes, but um, the doctor just like searched her person and removed it from her before tying her up. I don't know. I guess she got it back in any case. Now let's dance. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Let's drink with these fine people before we go do our thing. Are you enjoying yourselves here? I'm here to conduct a survey on who takes the shortest amount of time to pass out. A guy, a guy whose nickname is Dr. Death sent me. That guy has issues. You have to spend like a thousand dollars on a bottle of champagne just to get a dinky little table like that on a booth. I'd like bottle service, please. We're just gonna sit here all night and talk about the 2016 election. I love the way she pushes through the crowd. That guy like seems to grab my hand as I walk by. Can we talk to the bartender? Order a scotch? Hello, good sir. I don't have any money, I just have boobs. That just causes me to lean against the bar. It's an awesome view of the dance floor. They've got pole dancers and everything. That woman is way too happy. Someone should drown her cat in the toilet or something.
I can't dance on that one. I have to get right up close to where Paco is. This is the right one. Paco was like enthralled. Now she's doing a little booty shake. It's funny how Madison said earlier time to play the sexy girl as though she didn't think she was already a sexy girl. She doesn't seem to realize that she's sexy as hell even when she's not playing it. Hey you! Say hello to my little friends. They're my testicles, but I call them my little friends. Are you? Madison. I'm Madison. Would you like to do a line of coke off of my bunghole? Paco's accent is way overblown. Is this going to be a reprise of the Don Corneo scene from Final Fantasy VII? If you don't tell me my information, I'm going to rip them off. If you don't tell me, I'm going to bite them off. If you don't tell me, I'm gonna smash him. Cause Jaden is gonna come here too at some point, cause he has information. Maybe uh, Madison's gonna get herself in a little bit of trouble with Paco-san, and uh, Jaden's gonna come to the rescue. That would be an interesting collision of storylines. Make sure my gun is loaded one more time. Talk to the gun. Get out of there before I get into big trouble. Yeah, because he totally doesn't have any bodyguards anywhere near here. Everything is going to be closed. You step through one flimsy little door and it's like you're in another country, all alone with the guy. So, or at least a desert island. You've got excellent soundproofing, Paco. I'd like to hire your contractor for my apartment. I'd like to hire your DJ so, too. Show me what you can do. Take it off. Slowly. Oh my Take god. It off. There's gonna be a strip tease scene. I need to prepare for this.